Hey there guys, WolfTM2008 here and in this video I'm going to show you how you can disable the keyboard shortcut for high contrast settings. Now this is very useful if and when you are at school, college, university and your IT services department have not disabled this feature. This will basically stop you from potentially coming back to your workstation and finding out that it's been put back into or put into high contrast which is pretty annoying if you don't know how to get rid of it so the keyboard shortcut for high contrast is left shift alt and print screen all at the same time which will bring up this command window on windows 7 this keyboard shortcut is the same for windows xp as well so to disable it we basically go into the ease of access center on windows 7 this is different of course on windows xp so just to basically show you what high contrast is it is this Now this will obviously load a bit quicker depending on your graphic capabilities. So as you can see I have no desktop background. My text for the desktop shortcuts have changed and the colours in the bottom bar have as well. And there's no real niceness to it. Which is okay if you're not going to be using a bit of graphics power but it's rubbish. And it's not very nice especially if you're working on something and it just changes to this so let's go pop it back which is shift left shift alt screen. takes it out of it Okay, so now we're back to normal view. So again, left shift or print screen. Then we click to go into the ease of access center. And then we uncheck this tick box. Then we press apply. And okay. Now we can close this. And now if we do the same keyboard shortcut, it does not work. Now to get this back, all we need to do is type into here ease of access or ease and it'll open ease of access center or we can either go control panel and ease of access ease of access center and then we would go down and we would choose make computer easier to use or C and we would recheck this tick box and then apply it and OK. I'm going to leave that unchecked for the time being because I don't need it presently. So this was just a quick video to show you how you can disable the high contrast keyboard shortcut in Windows 7. Again it does depend if you're in an organisation and your IT services department have tweaked this setting for the end user so it's not accessible. However, I'm sure if you went and contacted them, you could easily get it disabled for your account. So, as you may realise, this is my first video in quite a while. Uh, I've recently finished all of my college work. So, you should be getting a more fluid volume of videos coming down the pipe. Just stay tuned for more videos, guys. Until next time, I will see you later. Bye-bye.